everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Vicki Lynn and welcome to my second vlog. So happy to be starting my second vlog. Sorry I'm kind of like rushing through this intro. I have to get ready for work and I have work in like an hour. I have to do my makeup quick. I don't have time for my hair. I wanted to get Starbucks but I guess I'm not gonna get Starbucks. Whatever. I work 11 to 3 today. Not too bad and usually for like the first hour I don't really do too much. So, it's a Monday, so it's slow, but it snowed outside and it looks so pretty, so I'm gonna show you guys, hold on. So, this is what it looks outside now. Um, it looks less than it did when it's the day it snowed. Um, but yeah, it's actually a really beautiful day because it's not freezing and there's a lot of light. So I'm glad that I'm up early. Also, a uh, secret to how I film this YouTube video, I'm literally just using this, these two windows for lighting and I pull the shades all the way up so I get a lot of light because it moved from over here uh, to over there now. So I'm not getting too much light, but I'm getting just enough because of the snow on the ground and the white light reflecting. So that works and you don't need a lot. And all I have is this mirror and then I prop the phone up right here so it doesn't take a lot to make a video. Anyone can do it, so get out there and make videos. I'm very unorganized. I hope my day doesn't go bad. I don't think it will, but I hope it does not. So I've been going to the gym a lot. Um, as I said in my last vlog, the second day I was going to the gym. This will be like my fifth day going. My legs have been so sore. I'm using the Valjean Labs Hydrate. Uh, I use this to prim help prime my face and I'm gonna use the Smashbox Cosmetics uh, Photo Finish Primer. To get ready for work, I don't use a lot of product. I usually just do like my foundation, my eyebrows, and a little bit of my eyes. Obviously, I'll put like bronzer and blush no highlight. Um, I never really put highlight. It's pretty dark where I work, so um, it doesn't really show as much. I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro Coverage Foundation in the shade Fair. I'm just going to apply that all over my face. Each time I run out of a foundation, I like to try a different one. If I really, really, really am in love with the foundation, then I may just buy two bottles just in case. Like Sometimes I want to switch it up, sometimes I don't. But usually I try different ones and I stick to it and I've been liking the foundations that I've been trying. The last foundation that I was trying before the LA Girl was the Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation. This was really good. Really full coverage. Had to stop wearing it because my tan went away. Which sucks! I hate when my tan goes away. I'm just taking the Smashbox Bronzer, the one that I usually always use in all my videos. It's in the shade Sunkissed Matte. That's the bronzer I'm using today. Oh, you guys can barely see me. When I'll see Jeffree Star's comment on Kylie's brushes, it's like, girl, those uh, brushes better be made out of horse hairs if they're gonna be like over $300. I cannot believe she's going to have people pay for $300 worth of brushes. Like, are you kidding me? She heard that she was like gonna become a billion, bi billion dollar business. She was like, all right, I gotta keep going for the top. The fudge. Fudge, I said. eyelashes are like super long like it's hard to tell on camera but they are really long and they are actually very hard to manage but I do want to try and get an eyelash lift soon that's all I'm gonna say for now about that I'm gonna use one of my favorite blushes which is the Clinique iced lotus blush and it looks like this oh it's so pretty You guys know how I do my eyebrows, so I'll see you in a second. So I'm ready for work now. Um, I did my hair. I put it in a bun and then like curled like these side 
little bang thingies. I don't know. I just wanted to do something a little different. Um, and also I just put on this perfume that I got for Christmas. Yes, I already got Christmas presents early. And it is the Sexy Blossom by Michael Kors. And it smells amazing and it looks so pretty. Hold on, let me open the box for you guys and I'll show you what it looks like. It's so pretty and it smells so good and it's light and it just smells like fruity and delicious and really good. I really wanted coffee before work, but I just don't have enough time. This also sucks because I wanted to pack my bag to go to the gym and because the gym is right next to my work, but now I can't because I don't have time, so now I'm going to have to drive the same exact distance twice in a day to go to the gym later. But whatever, that's okay because I want to come home anyway, and I'm going to drink my green boost juice instead of coffee, and yeah. I guess um, after work I'll come back, I'll clean, and then I will go to eat, and then go to the gym, and then come back and relax. Hey guys, I finally just got out of work and I got some chips. Thanks, my skin looks so poppin', oh my God. I started like about a month and like a week ago, I wanna say, and I have been like afraid to like ask them, oh, can I have some chips? Because when I first started, they were training me and they told me that I could have free food when I'm training, but now I'm not training anymore, so now I'm like afraid to ask because I don't wanna pay for anything because I'm cheap. But now I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna eat some of these chips, and I'm gonna make something for me to eat. Maybe I'll go to the grocery store first and pick something up to eat. I think I'll do that first. I just asked you guys as well um, if you guys want to ask me any questions about anything. I just asked you guys, and I'm going to put that at the end of the video. So hopefully you guys ask me some questions. If not, that's really disappointing, and I feel sorry for you. And yeah. So I'm at Price Shopper now, and I have to figure out how much money I have in my pocket in order to spend. And we have to buy healthy stuff. Have to. I have $15 to buy healthy groceries. You guys, I love fruit. Like, I'm obsessed with fruit, but not for that price. Look at how much it is. Squash is really cheap, but how does one pick a squash? Because I know you guys are just dying to know what I got at the supermarket. I got a squash, the mini squash, so I can uh, try to make a spaghetti squash. And then I also got some lettuce, some croutons, seltzer, because I like seltzer better than regular water. It is more flavorful. And I can definitely drink a lot more of this rather than regular water. I like the carbonation a lot. I got uh, Vermont Sharp Cheddar Cheese. Um, and then I also got some peas and some corn. So I'm going to start making the spaghetti squash. So let's get into it. So I'm going to preheat the oven to 350. Okay, so now I used a fork to scoop out the seeds in the inside. Now I'm going to spray it with some canned olive oil. Yes, I know, so healthy and delicious from a can, yes. Add some salt. We're also gonna add some pepper, duh. I actually looked again on BuzzFeed and it said 400 for the stove, so put it on 400, not 350. Also wanted to show you guys this tree. Let me know in the comments if you like the star. Let me know if you like it. I like it and I like the tree. I picked the trim on the bottom and the sparkles are rose gold. So obviously, you know I had to get it. I picked the snowflakes and the theme is red. I'm waiting for my food to be ready. It's also gonna take like about 40 minutes. So I'm gonna check on it at five o'clock. Um, and it's like 4.30 now. I'm watching Breaking Bad. I have gone through it like so fast. It's crazy. It just sucks because the episodes are so long, but it is so good. You guys have to watch it. Every episode is interesting and it always reels me in and wants, makes me want to watch the next episode. So make sure you guys watch this if you guys have nothing else to watch. The show is dope. I'm still watching Breaking Bad, but look at how good and yummy that this spaghetti squash looks like. Well, earlier I asked you guys to send me questions for a mini Q&A. I only got one entry, 
sadly, but it's okay. It was from Tree Balls, and they asked, when was the moment that you wanted to uh, start a YouTube channel? That moment was in my microbiology class two semesters ago. I just sat there and I was like, I really want to put myself out there, try and make some money, you know? I didn't care what people thought of me. I don't care what people think of me. I wanted to put content up, and I liked editing videos. I liked being girly and showing off my life because sometimes my life is funny. You know, I'm all about teaching others and helping others out. And a lot of my friends, before I started my YouTube channel, uh, they would always compliment me on my makeup, and strangers would always compliment me, and it would always make me very confident. And I loved to always give feedback and help people out if they had any questions, knowing that I'm helping someone else. Um, makes me feel really good. I love that feeling and that's why I wanted to start a YouTube channel. Sorry I was like rambling on for a little bit, but yeah, that's why. Hope you guys enjoyed my second vlog. Woo! I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a slow day, so I'm sorry. This is my life. Sometimes it's boring, sometimes it's cool. I'm gonna be doing more cool things. I just wanted to get a vlog out there the same day that I filmed it and edited it throughout the day to see how it was. This is how it is, so I hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I saw some comments from some uh, new YouTube channels on my last video, so go check it out. I love you guys so much, and I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog again. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like this video, and don't forget to follow me on social media. I love you guys so much, and thank you for watching. Watching.